Hello, you two. We're going to read together for the last time this term. I'm going to read for you a book called Don't Let a Spoon Bill in the Kitchen. It is written and illustrated by Narelle Oliver. Don't let a spoon bill in the kitchen. I see a spoon bill swishing side to side. His spoon is full of tiny shrimp gathered at low tide. Now, just in case you're wondering if his spoon can mix and pour... I'll give you a simple warning that you'd better not ignore. Don't let a spoon bill in the kitchen. I see a cormorant with wings stretched right out wide to dry like all the washing pegged up in the sun outside. Now, just in case you're wondering if he'll soak and spin dry too, I have a strong suggestion that I'd like to share with you. Don't let a camorant into the laundry. I see a pelican paddling in the sea. With giant beak that's like a bag, she traps fish for her tea. Now, just in case you're wondering if she packs that bag for travel, I have some words of caution or things really could unravel. Don't take a pelican to the airport. I see a jacana with feet so long and wide. Like snowshoes on the lily pads, she'll balance every stride. Now, just in case you're wondering if she'd like to try real shoes, I have one clear message to announce, not wanting to confuse. Don't take a jacara, jacana, sorry, to the shoe, stop, shoe shop. <laughs> Don't take a jacana to the shoe shop. I see a spindly stilt stepping lightly by. Like a dancer on tiptoe, she stays up high and dry. Now, just in case you're wondering if there's dance moves she might learn, here's my advice, which I'll declare in words both loud and stern. Don't let a stilt join the ballet. I see an osprey hovering like a kite, high above the sea until a fish swims into sight. Now, just in case you're wondering if there's kite tricks he can master, here's one demand that I must make, unless you want disaster. Don't take an osprey to a kite show. All the birds are sleepy now. They're flying home to rest. On floating beds of reeds and leaves or in a big stick nest. And just in case you're wondering if they're up for sleep time fun... There's one last warning you should hear, then all is said and done. Never, whatever you do, let those birds sleep over. And I really mean it. And that's the end of the story. Enjoy your final day of online learning for the term.